So I seen one of my homegirls make a video about her being a virgin. And it just brought back up memories and I'm bored up late. So I feel like talking about it. So let's talk about it. Okay, so I lost my virginity when I was 19 years old. Yes, I went to high school every school year without getting none. Like, And it wasn't like, oh, I'm waiting for the right guy. I'm waiting for marriage. It wasn't none of that. So a lot of people be saying, oh my God, it hurt it so bad. Oh my God, I cried. Oh my God, it was this and that. When I tell you that felt so damn good. I was off a of bleasy. <laughs> I'm losing my virginity in every position type. Like, no pain, no gain, nothing. Everything down to it. Down to this. I did every. I lose my virginity though. Like, that's kind of loud. But it's crazy because bro didn't even last long at all. Oh, uh, like, but I'm a virgin, so I don't even know, like, that's not normal at all, so I'm happy, like, I, I left, <laughs> I, not left, because it was at my mom's house, but I was satisfied, basically. One thing I regret is that my mom didn't teach me, like, the rules of having sex and, like, the precautions and what not to do, what to do. When I tell you I started wilding after I lost my virginity, I said, who's next? I'm telling you. After I lost my virginity, anybody I ever thought was attractive or I wanted to see what it was about, I tried it. I didn't care. I was wildin', one night stands type. I'm probably gonna be embarrassed after. Hopefully, this video don't blow up and just only like my supporters see it. But I don't know. Like this is my truth. Like it's probably why God said we're gonna get her pregnant. That's probably why. If you really think about it, I just told you guys, I lost my virginity at 19. I also got pregnant at 19. And no, it wasn't by the same guy that I lost my virginity to. That just tells you I was on the path of destruction. So God stroked down and struck me and he said, I'm going to save you. Oh, yeah. Y'all know I had to come and say something about this video. Two things popped out to me right away. One, her facial expressions cracked me the hell up. <laughs> I don't laugh when I've seen this video. I watched it like five times because of her facial expressions. <laughs> all right. And the second is for all of y'all feminists out there, all y'all women that saying women are better parents, men suck, blah, blah, blah. She said her mom... They teach her the rules of sex, the consequences of nothing. Let me repeat that. She said mom did not teach her. Oh, no, y'all ain't going to talk about this crap. No, y'all ain't. Because now y'all going to be like, uh oh, well, where's the dad at? Good question. Do not know. She did not mention that. Don't know if dad's in the picture. Don't know if dad passed away. Don't know what's going on. Don't know if dad is in her life. Don't know if she only brought up mom because she's a female. Mom's a female. Don't know. But I do know she said out her own mouth, her mom did not teach her the rules of sex, the consequences, all that stuff. And why not teach your little girls these things? Why not teach your little girl not to be out there wilding out the consequences of you know doing uh, 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 of doing all these things, cause she said she was wilding out. She said she was giving it all up. Yeah, that's what she said. She was giving it all up at the age of nineteen while she was out of high school. So I give her props for that. She wasn't a ne negative stereotype or negative statistic in this world. She wasn't like in school and pregnant. But she did become a teenage mom, so that's a that's one notch against her right there. But, but, she did say her mom didn't teach her. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm stuck on that because we see too many uh, 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 of all this crap, too much of all this crap. Well, women love to blame the man for everything. Well, the man, she didn't mention nothing about her dad. She didn't. She didn't mention not one single thing about dad. So, 
since she brought up mom, mom, how come you didn't teach your daughter not to be wilding out? Hmm? Now she's a single mother. Hmm? Yeah, yeah. All right then. Anyway, now, another thing, y'all, sexual liberation movement, y'all that's telling these little girls it's okay to have sex with any and everybody, y'all not teaching them the consequences of their actions. Y'all not at least teaching them how to be safe. Yeah. And she's, but I will give her props again because she did say she felt like God sent her this child to try to tell, teach her to stop wilding out. So if that's really how she felt, I'm glad she listened. Look, I don't know why y'all think that y'all can have sex like men do. First of all, men are not out there wilding out all crazy. Are there some men out there doing it? Yes. Yes, there is. So don't come on here talking crap. Yes, there are some men out there that just slang it everywhere. But y'all only focus on those on those guys. Why not the guys that's actually trying to do something positive, something real in this world? Y'all looking at rappers like Nick Cannon, Future. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? They're just slanging dick everywhere. But what about the guys that ain't doing that? There was a, 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 a study done that showed 52% of men are, are unmarried and childless, which means they have not, never been married and they have no kids. And they said 41%, I, th I, I forget the exact numbers, but I remember that 52% of men, if I can find this, this, that, uh, the stat, I'll show it to y'all, if I can find it. Anyway, then it said like 40 something percent or something like that, married with two kids. No, it just said 40 something percent two kids and it said uh, uh like 20 something I, I forget exactly the numbers but then it said two or more kids so most of the men on earth don't have no damn kids if i could find that stat i bring it up to y'all at the end of this video if i could find it anyway so with that being said though i will give her props she realized she was messing up she said, oh, let me stop. Because most of y'all women don't even, don't even understand how to stop. No, nah, no, y'all don't. So I give her a prize for that. Anyway. Anyway. So I just, like I said, I want to know how come y'all women are not trying to teach these young girls not to do these things. It's not going to work in their favor. Y'all making life harder on these little girls. And the crazy thing about it, she said when she lost her virginity, the first thing she thought about is who's next. That's crazy. She said, who's next? She was wilding out. She was having multiple sex partners all within one year. She said she lost her virginity at 19. She started wilding out and she had a baby. At, no, she said she got pregnant at 19. So she could have been 20 when she had the baby, but still. All that within one year. So uh, all the feminists, all this hashtag kill movement, uh, uh, kill men movement, excuse me. All these women that claim that men ain't no good. Men are horrible parents. Blah, blah, blah. Here go an example right here. The job full of shit. Now what? Words out of her own mouth. Now what? Okay, here it goes. I said, hey, Google, what is the percentage of men without kids? And this popped up. It said about 70% of all men aged 25 to 29 have no children. Compared to 45.6% of men age 30 to 34 and 28.4% of men age 35 to 39. 
However, among men age 20 and over, never married men are more likely to be childless than a similar age men who are who have, who have never been married. So that's a huge number of men without kids. So I know y'all women are telling men, I mean, excuse me, telling telling other women, I'm sorry, excuse me there, to, to, to have sex like a man. You could do anything a man could do. But men are not out here slanging dick like y'all think. Y'all just paying attention to the few guys that is and thinking that's all men. Hell, I don't. I don't. I only have two kids. Yeah. And I'm, I'm a married man. So now what? So if you're only paying attention to those negative guys, of course that's what you're going to think. But you got to open your mind and stop thinking like that. Here's proof right here. Don't believe me? Like I said, I showed you how to look it up. I showed you what I did. Hey, Google, what is the percentage of men without kids? This popped up. 